What's up guys and welcome back to Evo Land 2. In the last episode, well, we got Pokemonified when it comes to our art style here, but yeah, now we're back on our way to the forest because there are evil demons out to attack our village and uh, do a whole bunch of other evil stuff, I'm sure, but for now, <laughs> Our big goal is to uh, get back to the village and warn everybody, and hopefully it won't be like a Kid Karai's Wolf situation, people actually believe us, but now, let's go back to the clearing, all right. Everybody, everybody, we need your help! <laughs> okay, then. Oh, is there still evil rocks? They're still, they're, they're attacking the village now! This isn't good. Um, okay, let's take care of you too. There you go. Oh, there's a lot of stuff over here. Did we not already see all this? Huh, I don't know. It's odd, though, because the art style is so different, some of the enemies actually act differently. Except for the jellies. The jellies will always remain the same, won't they? <laughs> well, that just led me in a circle. Uh, that wasn't too helpful. Okay, then. Let's go back, though. We definitely gotta make our way... Let's make a beeline for the village. That way we're making progress and stuff. Okay. The village should be down this way. If not, we can check the map, correct? Uh, maybe we can't. Oh, wait. Uh, is there a map? Huh. <laughs> I guess there isn't. Okay, then. Um, hmm. How are we getting back, then? Oh, over here. Yeah, let's go take this bridge, and here we are. Um, what is eight gonna say? Uh, huh? Oh wait, the village is gone! Huh? Is that the problem? <laughs> my village! Where is it? My father! My friends! They're all gone! We need to keep our cool. There's gotta be a logical explanation. My dad always told me everything had a logical explanation. I sure hope he was right about that. Uh. It's like my village never existed. Zebra, do you have any idea what could have happened? I, I figured that when we went back in time. Oh really? Well, that's reassuring. Oh well, I was glad I can help in any way possible. This must be connected to our f fight with the Guardian. Maybe they took shelter in the mountains. Let's go there now. I'm sure everyone's safe and sound. I don't think that's the case. I think that people are, oh wait, oh there's a little thing here. Hello, who are you? Well, what do you know? We don't get many visitors around here. You're trying to escape the war, right? No. Well, then you must be running from something else. You've got nothing to fear here, and we're far from all of the mayhem. Anyway, that's why I decided to stick around. Huh? Weird, he reminds me of my father a bit. Well, maybe he is. He's not from my village, in any case. And he doesn't seem to know why it disappeared. Okay. Psst, Zebra, don't pay too much attention to him. The war ended a long time ago. My guess is he's off his rocker a bit. Or maybe we went back in time. At this point, it's pretty obvious, I think. Okay, let's get this stuff, and then we'll go check out his little hut here, though. What is this about? Um, can I, oh, I can't go into it. <laughs> Buddy, I just wanna hang out in your hut. Okay, then, let's see. Oh, there's a little axe. Can I take this? That'd be really cool if I could, but it doesn't look like I can. So he's like building a village. That might actually be her father. Okay, then, what is down here? Um. Oh my, not much of anything. Okay, and anything down here? Nope. <laughs> Gosh, start a game, I wanna explore, well, let me explore. <laughs> okay then, so we're off somewhere else. Where are these docks about? Hmm, not much of anything. I'm guessing if we ever get a boat, we can take it to the seas there, but for now, we must travel off this way. And what will we find? Um, the mountains, okay, here are the mountains. They're all white peaked grizzly pass. That sounds pleasant. Okay, oh my, well, what do you know? There's grizzlies here. Hey, 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 let's talk about this. Um. Ready, 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 ah, <laughs> take that. Okay, then these grizzlies really do seem to be a little fearsome. All right, take you out, come on. Ooh, we can take them out pretty easy, though. Just gotta spam that button, there you go. And then go up here, whoa, whoa, was that up there? <laughs> like a floating monkey up there. <laughs> and spiders, spiders are pleasant. Um, Boom, okay, I took out a few there, or, or maybe just one. <laughs> okay, and then, uh-oh, we gotta go into a cave. Oh no, it's like a Scooby-Doo maze. Oh, oh gosh. It's like a little monkey spirit. <laughs> okay, let's go down here. Oh my, so there's a lot of stuff going on. Wait, isn't this just where we came from? It is. Well, I went in a circle. Maybe it's like one of those things where if we enter it twice, maybe that'll help. Here, let's enter it, and then enter it. Ha ha, it is, I suspected so. Oh, he's shooting web at me? All right, buddy, you're asking for it. Boom, take out two of them right here. One of them jumped over, though. I, I, I can't be mad, that's pretty impressive. There you go, get rid of him. Then, luckily, the uh, shrubs drop a lot of health, which is cool. We haven't died yet, either, which is a good thing. All right, so I guess we gotta do that, then. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Pretty simple. And then let's... Wait, wait, wait. Uh, boom. Take you out, just to make that a little bit easier. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I'm sort of surprised I was able to dodge that, but boom. 
And then they, they just try really hard to attack me. They go on, oh no, I died! Uh-oh, what's it gonna be then? Oh no, we gotta start from way back here. All right, I'll be right back. All right, we're doing a bit better this time. I wanna try to take this guy out. There you go. That makes it a bit easier if we can take out these guys from a distance. But what I really like about this game is that one thing, it sticks true to its name. It's called Evil Land, and the, the land, from what I've gathered so far, evolves like a video game or video games have, you know, first it was all 8-bit and pixely, and now it's, you know, getting a little more advanced, and then hopefully eventually it'll be 3D and stuff, and that's pretty cool. It's completely rusted. It would take at least a good smack for it to budge. Uh, is that, okay, well, let's try this. That did, oh, that did work. I was, for a moment, it didn't seem like it did. Ooh, the opening has opened. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. If you haven't noticed, I have a very large vocabulary. All right, let's go through here. And Ooh, and there's another one here. And right, then we'll have to try to find that opening to take care of the spider first. But yeah, the land evolves, so hopefully we can see some really cool stuff in this game. But hopefully it does it like at a good pacing. I wouldn't want to stick to like one area for super duper long. I'd want to see like all the different evolutions this game has. Anyways, let's um try this. This brings me up here, and it looks like there's another lever here. So let's, oh, she can't go through the rock. Huh, that's an interesting prospect. I'll have to make sure to remember that. She cannot go through the rock, so we gotta, uh, Make sure that we're directly in front of it, just like this. And what will that do? Uh, something. <laughs> Who knows what? Did it open up, I'm guessing, this one over here? No, it didn't. Okay. Maybe there's several several lovers that we have to do for this one. Who knows? Uh, let's take you guys out when we can. Ooh. They're tough. They're really tough because when they get close to you, or just like at any point in time, they can just do that invisible swing, and it's tough to dodge because it follows you, but boom. There you go. All right, so from here, we need to hit this lever. There you go. And now with both of those hit, this door will open. Cool. All right, and so let's go back and then go into our newly, freshly opened door and see what's in there. Hopefully something cool. Let's go and go on through. <laughs> yeah, okay. For a moment, I was like, was that the right door? Did I go through the wrong one? <laughs> that move that we have, though, is really good. Eight is actually a pretty cool character so far when it comes to her abilities. Okay, how do we do this? Oh, we need to go on the other side. But how do we do that? Oh, there's another door. Okay, <laughs> pretty easy stuff. We also did hit level four when I was getting myself back to where we were. So we're already even pretty close to level five too. So we're making good progress as well. All right. So I'm curious if we should even bother with picking up money. I'm a little suspicious that the game's pulling a prank on us. Because you know, the first area, the game was all like, you know, like it was all like, you don't even need money. And then it's like, now all of a sudden we have all this money to collect. Are we even gonna be able to spend any of it? <laughs> That's the question I'm asking now. All right, then let's charge up and then let it rip. Nice, okay, so there we go. That door will open. And what'll be inside of here? It will be a save point, I'll take it happily. And then what is this stuff? Can I push this? I can't. Hmm, maybe I could, yes I can. <laughs> that is actually a very diverse move. I thought it would be like Pokemon where it only takes out like, like you know, grass specifically, like, like a tall tree or something. But no, it actually has a lot of different uses. Okay, ooh, ooh, there you go. No, 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 no. Stop landing on my head, man. Okay, there's raindrops falling on my head, except the raindrops are about 500 pounds and are made out of solid rock. <laughs> okay, um, let's actually charge shot so I don't have to deal with the shrubs, just like that. That was actually nice and helpful. And I got some of my health back. I think I actually gained more health there than I lost, but there's still rocks falling, so, ouch. <laughs> it's hard to dodge them. Okay, Mr. Mr. Bears, why don't you get hurt by the rocks? You just have rock immunity? Are you a rock type? Is that the problem here? Okay, well, we can hit them away with the uh, charge shot, but that isn't easy either. Um, oh, oh geez, oh geez, I'm about to die. Um, I'm just gonna hold the charge. Okay, we're in safety now, we're in safety. Can I have another save point, please? Or another level to put, lever to push, sure? I can't say lever, apparently. No, no, I'm not ready for this. I am not one bit ready for this. I'm just gonna keep running until I have a situation that I'm comfortable with. Pick up any health that I can. I'm just gonna keep running in circles that hopefully dodges their tornadoes, and then hit them with my charge shot whenever I can. So like, do that, and that one shot that guy, that's good. And then come over here and, no, no, no. Whenever they go invisible, I just gotta back out. <laughs> back it up, Zebra, back it up. Okay, no, 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 stop it. Stop it right now. <laughs> okay, I could maybe get two of them here. There you go, nice, we did. All right, let's gotta keep doing that. Get you, then, no, no, no. Ooh, yeah, wait, no. <laughs> You gotta sort of sneak up behind them, but it ain't easy. Oh no, did I get, I didn't get anybody there. All right, okay, we got that one, got that one. We're almost done here, we're almost done here. Just keep playing it safe, keep playing it safe. There you go, no, really dude? Stop that, stop that right now. All right, where are you up here? Um, there's you, 
do that for you real quick. All right, and now lastly, this guy. Oh, nope, or I could just run into him. He didn't even have to throw anything there. I did the work for him. Oh, come on, come on. No! Why? No, stop! No, we died on the last one, really? Ah! Oh. All right, you ain't getting me this time. There you go, you jerk. <laughs> awesome, all right then. So we got everything. Yeah, we can go on through now. We're almost at 400 coins, even though I don't think it matters, so. There we go, we dealt with all those horrible enemies, though. There we go, 400 coins. And now what's, oh my! Hello, big guy. What is this? Look, zebra, a mammoth. I thought they'd all gone extinct because of global warming. Well, maybe they did. Anyway, this one is blocking our way forward. I find it funny she hasn't pieced it together yet. Ah, I know. I'll use a bracelet of great strength I, I bought from a trader the other day. Usually you'd have to go to some type of dungeon for those kind of things, but nowadays with the modern consumerism, it's pretty nice and easy. I'll shove that mammoth off the path in no time. All right, give it a shot. It ain't working. What's going on? <laughs> hmm? It's not working. Could it be that the trader sold me a dud bracelet with a no with no magic at all? If I mind, if I find him, he's gonna wish he'd never met me. <laughs> well, I'm fresh out of ideas. I'll leave the problem solving in your hands, zebra. <laughs> okay. Well, maybe we could just talk to him. Hi. No, can I, I can't walk right by him. So. We'll do, yeah, we'll do the same thing we've been doing with everything else so far. <laughs> Not too complex, and then we're almost here at the top of the mountain. There's another one. Well, let's save up real quick. All right then, and then let it rip. I mean, we'll just keep on doing the same things. Okay, so what is down here? Oh, there's a little chest. This is probably gonna be another star piece, I'm assuming. Let's find out. No, it's an Oricon ore, an exceedingly rare ore used to make powerful gear. And that is awesome. I'm guessing we can make some cool gear with it then. All right, let's get you, buddy. Bah, there you go. Oh, that doesn't do anything. <laughs> okay, then. Let's go back over here, then. Yeah, we can just make the work around here. And, and then, oh, there's, huh. I wonder what we can do here. Can I, like, hit you again to get you out of the way? No, nah, you refuse to move now. So, huh, what is up with this? Huh, I'm not really sure where that other one would lead, then. Huh, weird little puzzle. Okay, do a bit of, ah, wait, no. Get out of here, you stinker. <laughs> All right, then what's up here? Uh, how do I do this? Um, you can't, that that just brings me back. It's not a little puzzle here. So I need to find a way to get him out of the way, but he just won't do it. Um, maybe if I hit him like this? No, he just doesn't move anymore, so I'm a little clueless. Ah, there we go. So now he can run over here, and which is sort of helpful, because now, or maybe, oh. Oh, now I see what I need to do, but how do I do it? I might be stuck. Uh oh, please don't tell me I'm stuck. How in the world do I do this now? Hello? No, I can't go by now. There's no way. Uh-oh. I honestly think I'm stuck. How in the world could I get out of here? I can't, oh, I guess I could knock, oh, you know what? I can't knock this guy back this way. And get him to run back over. And now I just gotta make my way down here, move him over, move that guy over. <laughs> it's a course of events, isn't it? All right, now I can tell you to get on out of here. You're gonna run over there like that. I'm gonna walk back down here and dodge this mammoth, or mammoth, or whatever it is, <laughs> and go through here, and then haha, we have solved the puzzle of the evil elephants that are now back. Hooray! <laughs> okay, let's hit you out of the way. Let's see what we can do with this one. Oh, here's a door opening here. Then what's going on with the rest of it? Like, is this a puzzle? Are they supposed to stand on that thing? Huh, not sure. Hmm, that might be the case. What happens if we charge this up and do that? They're gonna run down there, and then I charge it up again, and then boom. Is this what they're supposed to do? Appears as so. Okay, so now what we must do is get you over there, and which might be easier said than done. What if we do that? Nothing happens, uh, but where else could we hit you? Hmm. I mean, they're pretty big. They don't fit in much, you know, much different, you know, places. So um, maybe we can do this: discharge and let loose. Um, now he goes over here, though, you know, and that's not really what I'm looking for. Unless, yeah, he can't go up. So he's in a pretty useless spot to me, for the most part. Like I can get this guy down here, and he can run down that one. And it's like I could get this guy over here, but why would that be all that helpful? I mean, I guess I could do something, right? <laughs> okay. But how do I get you down? Maybe I can't, maybe you're just an inconvenience. Um, hmm, let's try this. Boom. And then, 
Huh. Well, let me try. Can I go? I can't go down that way. So to actually go down and get that dude, I need to hit you back. So, boom. And then you're gonna run away. Okay, I'm starting to figure this out a bit. I think what I need to do is I need to hit you to the right, then I need to hit you downwards. Yeah, I think this'll work, I think this'll work. So we just do that. Ha, <laughs> I think I got it, guys, I, I think I got it. Watch, 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 watch. Um, then I gotta go down here, <laughs> do the whole work around with everything. At least we're getting our cardio workout for the day. And then now I just hit you to the left, and then we're good, we're good to go, ready, boom. Nice, okay, we got it. There's the door opening, we just gotta hit that mammoth out of the way, and then we're good to go. <laughs> wow, weird puzzles going on here. Weird mammoth puzzles. Okay then, let's do that. And then let's get out of here, ready? All right, cool, there's the save point, so for now, I think we'll head out. Thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, make sure to give it a like, share with your friends and family, and comment in the comment section below. If you've watched this point in the video, make sure you comment Mammoth Puzzle, so that I know you've watched to the end of the video, and that you're a zebra-tastic viewer, but your support really does help, because this is a mini-series, so the amount of support, you know, sort of determines how much longer the series will go on, but thank you guys so much for watching, I'll see you guys next time, bye-bye.